Now, hi guys, Jasper Hewitt here from Bushwacker Africa. Congratulations on your brand new Bushwacker Sundowner. So you had some questions, and I thought I'd do this short video about the plumbing and water system, just to help you understand how it all works on your new Sundowner. This will apply to the Sundowner Classic and the Evolution model. So we have on board a hot water system driven by gas, the 5 liter gas geyser, which mixes pre-mixes the hot water through to your mixing tap. You have a mixing tap, hot and cold. We have a gas regulator flow valve on the, on the geyser that controls the heat on the water system. And we have a flow valve under the geyser which controls the flow through the system. So the slower the water will feed through the gas geyser, driven by the pump, and the higher the gas, the hotter the water will be. So if you slow it right down, you may get a pulsating effect where it goes boop, 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 boop. That's quite normal if you really want hot water. You slow it right down, you can get up to about 60 degree temperature water out of your tap. Otherwise, you just release the flow slightly and it flows, flows evenly and you get a cooler 35, 40, 50 degree temperature depending on what you want. And you can use that same setting for your shower, which we'll get to. We have a main switch there which op operates the pump, the pressure pump. And then you have a, pressure, a water gauge here which gives you the indication level of your tank. As you see, the tank's empty at the moment. We have mounted an aluminium tank in the chassis above the axle to distribute the weight evenly, which has a capacity of 140 litres. That's a great amount of water, but at times you want to save that water if you're on trips off grid camping. And I'll get to that feature too. So there it is, there's your geyser, your mixer tap, your flow system through the geyser, your main pump switch opens and closes with the tap. And then we have also a 12 volt system wired into your geyser from the main battery system. So that always gives power to ignition system and it eliminates the use of having to have batteries in there, which do run out and go flat over time. So that's an added value package that we add to the Bushwacker water system. So on your sundown at the back, we have a second outlet tap, which is the red tap here at the back right hand corner. That's hot water. That supplies water to your shower unit for the, for the shower and also to your handheld shower that you get with your sundown. And the temperature then you pre-mix on the geyser, open this tap up, control it with your flow switch on the, on the handheld shower or the rose, and you've got hot water ideal for showering. Then we also have two taps mounted at the left hand rear corner and right hand rear corner of your steps. The left hand tap underneath here, which is protected into the chassis, is, to, is used for draining your water from the tank. So you open that tap up, the water will drain from your tank. You can lift the nose up to make sure you get everything out, but that's your drainage tank, tap, tap, tap for the tank. Right here, we have another tap, which is a great feature that Bushwacker offers. And this allows you to override the main tank by plugging this in into your outlet over there. You can then drop this into a container like that, which is full of water. Open up this valve, and that allows you then to suck water from this container through the geyser to your washing up area and your shower, saving your onboard water. And you've all wondered why I have this in my hand, and you've asked the question, what is this for? So this is an important part of equipment that comes with your sundowner. And we use this one to isolate the main tank so that we can draw water from that container. So if you're looking underneath your chassis, at the back of your tank is a valve there. Now that, in the open position, allows the pump to draw water from the main tank. Insert this round part with a spigot on it, over the tap, it locates, then you can twist it, closed, like that, 90 degrees, open 90 degrees, that way. So once it's closed as it is there, that means you cannot suck water from that tank. It'll only take water from your external source of water, which is great for having plenty of showers and uh, saving your onboard water. So there you have it, guys. This, that's your water system on the Sundowner range, classic and evolution. We look forward to hearing from you. Enjoy the video. You know the deal. www.bushwacker.co.za. We're there to serve you. Thank you.